So, hi guys. Good day. Have a blessed day. So, ngayon, uh, siguro nagtataka kayo bakit may may nagtatanong na ano, yung katanungan natin na sasagutin natin ngayon kung paano pupunta sa impyerno. But before that, uh, ano muna? Uh, unahin muna natin yung kung paano pumunta sa langit. No? No, so, alam nyo pa na kung saan tayo papunta kapag tayo mamatay. So, isinulat niya sa diba sa 1 John 5.13 sabi niya I write these things to you who believe in the name of the Son of God so that you may know that you have eternal life. So, ipagpapalagay natin na ano, suppose you will standing before God right now. No? So, at tatanungin ka niya na kung bakit ka papun, pa, papasokin sa langit. So, ayun, ano bang ano, ano bang may sasagot mo? Hmm? Tatanungin ka, bakit ka papapasokin sa langit? So, sabi niya sa John 3.16, hmm? For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. So, yun yun, guys. So, so una, kailangan nating ma maintindihan yung problema kung bakit uh, ano, bakit tayo kailangan pumunta sa sa heaven. Di ba? So, yun. So, yun yung problema. Di ba? Dahil yung ating mga kasalanan, sino ba sa inyo ang ano, sino sa inyo ang walang kasalanan? Ha? ba lahat tayo so, dahil sa kasalanan yun yung nakasagabal sa atin para makapasok tayo sa langit kasi sabi niya no, so, uh, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God no? Romans 3.23 so yun no? hindi natin may liligtas ang ating sarili ayan siya bakit? bakit nasabi natin hindi natin may liligtas ang ating sarili kasi sabi niya For by grace, you have been saved through faith. And this is not of yourselves. No? And it is the gift of God, not by works, so that no one should boast. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 8 to 9. So ano yun? Diba? Deserve, deserve tayo ng kamatayan at ng impyern. Kasi ang payad sa ating kasalanan ay ano, kamatayan. Romans 6:23. Diyan, 'di ba? Kasi God is holy and just. So, he must punish our yun know, dahil sa pagmamahal niya sa atin, ano, he binigay niya si Jesus Christ para mamatay para sa ating mga kasalanan. Sabi niya, no? I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through except through me. No? John 14:6. Ayun. So si Jesus Christ namatay para sa atin doon sa cross. Kasi sabi niya, for Christ died for sins once for all. The righteous for the righteous the unrighteousness to bring to bring you to God. Now, first Peter 3:18. So, ano 'yon? Jesus was resurrected from the dead, no? So, he was delivered over to death for our sins and was raised to life for our justification. Romans 4:25. So, balikan natin yung tanong. Paano ko no? Paano paano ko masisiguro nakakapupunta ako sa langit pag ako ay namatay. So, ang ay sagot ay ito. Uh, ang sagot, Believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. Acts 16.30 To all who receive Him, to those who believe in His name, He gave the right to become a children of God. John 1.12 So, you can, you can receive, uh, you can receive a gift through Jesus Christ. No? Because the gift of God is eternal life in Jesus Christ our Lord. No? Sa Romans 6.23.
you can live a full and meaning, meaningful life right now at the moment no so yun kasi sinabi ni Jesus ang sabi niya I come I have come that they might have life might have life and have it to the full John chapter 10 verse 10 so you can be you can spend eternal life with Jesus Christ because he promised that and he if, if I go to prepare a place for you I will come back and take you to be with me that you may also be where I am John 14 3 so you can accept this uh, this new uh, this new life in Christ no the the eternal life in Christ no? so this there's no other prayer that you can I can bring you to heaven so through this prayer no? you can uh, follow after me through this prayer so uh, if you are very you are right now kung saan ka ngayon so pray this prayer right now so, God I know that I have sinned uh, against you and I'm deserving to be punished but Jesus Christ took the punishment that I deserve so that through faith in him I could be forgiven. I place my trust in you for salvation. Thank you for the one for your wonderful grace and forgiveness. Amen. So have you made a decision to follow Jesus right now? So if you've made the decision to follow Jesus right now, you can click the button subscribe for so that we can, ano, uh, may, ano, ma, ma, ano pa kayo sa next na video natin, ma, ma remind kayo, and more, if you want more knowledge about heaven, I will share it to you. But, another question to be answered is, how to go to hell? How to go to hell? It's very simple, guys. So, to go to hell is, don't pray the prayer. No? So, forget about what I've said to you. Ayan. If you want to go to hell, forget about what I've shared to you right at the moment. So, if you want to go to hell, but if you don't want to go to hell, then continue. No? Continue for, for to continue to be with God, continue to grow in the knowledge of God. So, guys, uh, if you don't want to go to hell uh, if you want to go to hell I mean then don't share this don't share this video but if you want others to go to heaven then and to listen this this message please don't forget to share this message guys and I know that God has a wonderful plan for your life so continue if you have more question just uh, ask it in in the comment sec section hmm? thank you for watching and thank you and you can thumbs up if you like this video and if you want more updates then continue continue guys so, and that's all i hope you learned more hmm? so salamat Sana. Ayun. Thank you so much, guys. And uh, if you want uh, to be prayed for, uh, please don't forget to 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 mm, don't forget to like. Uh, I mean, yes, like. Uh, if you want to be prayed for, or comment your prayer request below. Uh, in the comment section so that's all guys and also um, don't forget to click the bell button that's all guys and hope to see you in the next in my next uh, sharing uh, thank you so much and have a blessed day